Welcome back, everyone. I'm Stephanie Gorin. On this first evening of Hanukkah, a special project is underway in Burlington. It aims to preserve a long hidden piece of the past while honoring Jewish immigrants who left Eastern Europe for a new home in Vermont. WPTZ's Jack Thurston reports from Burlington. It may just be a door frame to an apartment, but for Aaron Goldberg, this is a time portal. We are walking literally into the past. That opens onto a spectacular 1910 mural. The colors are just magical. Hidden, boarded up for nearly 30 years. By saving and preserving the mural, we are saving a piece of the past. Long before this was an apartment house, this was a synagogue, High Adam, in a neighborhood in the old north end of Burlington, Vermont, once called Little Jerusalem. More than a century ago, the growing congregation here hired an artist to create a traditional Eastern European Jewish mural, meant to bring worshipers closer to their faith. It depicts the Ten Commandments and ancient tabernacle, with visual references to liturgy. These were remarkable people. Historian Jeff Potash is part of an international fundraising effort with still well over $100,000 left to go to stabilize and clean the paint and protect the plaster, hoping to return it to the Burlington community so more can learn about the city's immigrant history. We are the inheritors of, of their legacy. Um, so at some level, it's an opportunity to, to, to be grateful. The plan for next year is to very carefully remove this mural and bring it up the street here to the current synagogue, Ohavi Zedek, to be reinstalled. To the best of my knowledge, this is the first time that a mural like this in three dimensions has been picked up and moved. Structural engineer Bob Neald first needs this temporary space built around the outside of the old building to shore up the mural from behind and prepare it for the move, still months away. It is quite complicated. With so many examples of pre-Holocaust Jewish art destroyed during World War II or lost to years of neglect, project planners are eager to see this rare treasure shine again. In Burlington, Jack Thurston, WPTZ News Channel 5.